Hey, what up, man? You know it's your boy, a little stretch. You already know the shit, man. I got my nigga with me, man. Hey, go on and introduce yourself, man, real quick, man. Let the people know who you is, man, where you come from, and all that good shit, man. My name Trey. I'm from New York, Brooklyn, aka Termite. You know what I'm saying? Brooklyn by way of the Pueblos, South Central Los Angeles, back to Brooklyn. It is what it is. That's a fact. That's a fact. So uh, so you a New York native, right? The fact. Born and raised in New York. But you bang the Pueblos out of South Central, right? That's a fact. And you and I seen I seen a lot of your flicks and all that. You'd have been to hood days. I seen you in the projects. So you'd have been over to hang with real niggas, man, and mess some real, some real Pueblos, right? That's a fact. That's a fact, man. Right, right. I've been so, uh, say it again. I've been stomped through the bricks, east side to the west side of LA. When I first went to LA, I stayed in the Hoovers on 97th and Fig, right by the whole stroll. The hotel's right there on the corner. The uh, the uh, we we call it bodegas in New York, but the little Mexican joint right around the corner and shit. Got the OG Hoovers hanging out over there. So yeah, I, I, I've been down and shit. I've been around. That's, what, that's what's up. That's what's up. So as you being a, a New York native, but you banging a, a, a West Side hood, right? That's a fact. So, so, so tell us a little bit about that, man. Tell them on how different the politics is and as far as this blood shit. You know what I'm talking about? What the politics is, it's different politics. You know what I'm saying? On the West Coast, the politics is more neighborhood politics. In New York, it's more of a, a whole borough thing. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Especially when we hit the penitentiary, it's politics as far as the neighborhood, who you know, where you from, or, you know what I'm saying, what line you push in. And it's a lot of politics in New York as far as the down culture. LA, it, it, it's kind of different. It's like, you know, your neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? Your neighborhood is where you from. Your neighborhood, they know you. So it ain't like, oh, he say he's from whoop de whoop but the nigga never touched the turf. So if you, if you bang in the hood, niggas know you. Niggas know you. Ain't no saying, oh, I'm from over here, I'm from over there, and nobody don't know you. You gotta be from there for niggas to know you. You know what I'm saying? It's not like you can say I'm from this hood, but I'm from over here in uh Mississippi or or woo woo. You know what I'm saying? As long as the line got pushed to that state, niggas know who you are. That's that's a that's a fact. That's a fact, man. That's a super fact because you know I'm from LA, man. You know, you know, FHM, man, FTB, and I, I know all my homies, you know what I'm saying? That's 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 a super fact. But now, far as far as you being a uh, a New York blood, but you being a, a West Side set, um, how you feel about that? Because you got a lot of gangs that's birthed on the East Coast, right? But you banging a gang that's birthed on the West Coast, right? That's a fact. So, real quick, give me the difference on that too, because it is a difference. It shouldn't be a difference, but it is a difference between. A west side blood and east side blood as far as west coast and east coast, right? It shouldn't be because we supposed to be bloods, but it is a such thing now of east coast blood and a west coast blood. You know what I mean? I mean, it's a lot of pushback because, you know, it's like in New York, especially in the penitentiary, it's like, you know, if you're not homegrown from New York, they, they, a lot, I, I won't say they don't, they don't respect it, but they're ready to push a, a New York line. Like how you pushing a West Coast line? You from New York? This New York? Woo woo! This what we do. The politics is different. The neighborhoods is different. The way we bang is different. The way we get our money is different. It's all different, but it's one B. You know what I'm saying? So I I tell the homies like this, man. I said we all on the one B, man. Like this is what I chose. You know what I'm saying? This is what I chose to 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 to, to be with. You know what I'm saying? A- ain't nothing against the homies in New York. I'm from New York. I'm from Brooklyn. But as you can see right now. It's a lot of homies on, on the East Coast that's pushing West Coast hoods. Maybe with the, the information they got was different. They got real right, and they figured, like, listen, maybe I was banging wrong the whole time. Mm-hmm. Maybe I was banging wrong the whole time. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, let me tell you something. They put a work on the East Coast, they put a work on the West Coast. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, I don't judge nobody. I don't judge nobody. I don't, I don't say nobody. Oh, you, you should do it this way or you should do it that way. Everybody got politics. So everybody choose what they want to be with. You know what I'm saying? Or what, what, what they fall under. This what this what I chose to be with. You know what I'm saying? As me being born in Brooklyn, New York. You know what I'm saying? I just, the motherland is the motherland, man. 
Like, like, like how the Muslims do it. They say, like, you got to make your pilgrimage to Mecca. LA is the Mecca. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? LA is the Mecca. You know and what I'm saying? I, so, and I, and I respect that. And uh, this ain't no bash to no homie banging nah. the side set. I'm just glad to have you on here because you're the first homie I got that's a New York native on my podcast at Bangor West Side Hood. So I thought that shit was dope. That's why I'm glad to have you. But I ain't bashing nobody. You know what I'm saying? And, I, and you and you absolutely right because, you know, it's already understood. The whole world knows this Crip and Blood shit started in L.A. And my opinion is how you going to be a Crip or, or Blood and not tap in with the, the roots. You know what I'm saying? No bigger eyes, little use. I'm not shitting on nobody from no other state, no other city, but how you ain't gonna tap in with the roots where it started from? You get what I'm saying? And That's a fact. You did ain't that. You, you got the real roots. You done met some real OG bloods. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. That's a fact. I met homies from Bounty Hunters, Rams, uh, uh, Fruit Town Power Rules. I met homies from Grape Street, Broadways. You know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody bigger than the program. You know what I'm saying? Real respect, real, no matter where you're from. What state you from? Just like how the music game go. Nigga, we go to Atlanta, real niggas respect real niggas. You go to LA, real respect. You go to New York, real respect, real. That's what and it is. You know too, what Trey, let them know when you came to LA and you was moving around all them different blood sets, being a, a, a born and raised New York nigga, didn't niggas show you that blood love? Wasn't it love? Now they showed me blood love. They, you know, you know it was, bro? They was happy to see that shit. They yeah. was happy, like, that's a fact. They, they, you know, they respected the beat card. They're like, damn, the beat card is going worldwide. Like, motherfuckers is tapping it, and they love that shit. You know what I'm saying they love that the homies is it, it, uniting. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 it ain't no segregation or separation. They love that shit. That's they the, love that the tap in. You know what I'm saying? It ain't like oh, we bowing you know, to the West Coast or niggas got to Nah, it ain't. It ain't about that. You know what I'm saying? The B is the B, man. The B go worldwide, man. You know what I'm saying how big, wide. And where I'm said it, ain't nobody bigger than the program, man. That's a fact. That's a fact. <laughs> nobody bigger than the program, no matter where you're from. Ain't nobody bigger than the program, man. This is what it is, you know. But the politics, listen, I'm not I'm not gonna change nothing that already been set in stone 50, 60 years ago. Who the fuck am I? I can't change that. I can't change that. Every state you go to, they got their own twist, the way they do it. Every 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 state is different. Every state is different, you know what I'm saying? But my thing is this, if a nigga say he from Fruit Town, or he say he from, from Villains, or he say he from this, nigga, you can't change that history. You can't change that. Motherfuckers already put their life on the line for that. You can't change that. Niggas is doing 30, 50 years, 100 years for that. You can't change that. Just like the homies out here in New York, Sean Boys, Trey Boys, you can't change that. You got niggas doing 100 years for that. You can't change that. Thanks. I don't care where you from. Down right. south, Florida, mid, you can't change that. That's just already set in stone. Right. You know what but, I'm I, but see, my opinion, I ain't trying to change it. I just want the world to give us our due diligence on this on this bloodshed and where it started from. I, I, I get it. Shine niggas, Billy niggas, whatever. It's no diss or no knock to none of them. That ain't what I'm trying to do. Like you said, nigga, they didn't, didn't did it for X amount of years. They got dead homies. They got niggas in feds that's never come home just like me and you, right? But I'm saying, get respect to the land where it started from. You know what I mean? As a West Side nigga, that's all I want. That's all I want, nigga. You know, you know what I'm saying? Pay homage to where it started from. And I ain't saying bow down, bigger eyes, little use, or you gotta, you know what I mean? Whatever, whatever stain you got per se, because I know that they talk that talk, whatever. You ain't gotta, you know what I mean? You ain't gotta bow down to me or bow down to one of my big homies over here, but. Give respect, man, and pay homage to these bloods. You know what I'm saying? That's over here. That's that's been doing it too. You know what I'm saying? And, and every and, and, nigga, and, and, homie, that it came from the East Coast, from down south, that came to LA, that's a blood paru. They got super mad love. And you witness and you know it. We ain't, we, we not bred it like that to beef with, with homies. You know what I'm saying? We bred it to beef with the other side. You get what I'm saying? And I want more New York and East Coast homies to understand that and know that. Like when you come to LA, you banging this blood shit. We got your back and we gonna fuck with you if you were hunting. Period. That's and you right. and you were living testimony to it because you moved around the project, you did all this shit. You were telling me about all type of shit. So I knew you went online. I got to see your pictures. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you came over, got you some tacos, got you some enchiladas. <laughs> you know what I mean? And so, that's a fact. That's a fact, man. 
I, t- I, I, I always tell my homeboys, I said, damn, nigga, I went to L.A., man. I said, nigga, I'm thinking I'm going to get some motherfucking soul food. Them niggas busting out the enchiladas and all that shit. I said, what the fuck? It, it kind of fucked me up and shit. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. I understand motherfucking California used to be a part of Mexico. Fact. You know what I'm saying? So the demographics are different. I understand the, that. You the know the Spanish probably, don- I don't know the correct numbers, but I think they, they dominate LA right now. You gotta think Los Angeles. That's the Spanish name within itself. The Los Angeles. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? So it's not about like, like you said, it's not about bowing down or, or, or you know, but yeah, uh, nigga, I, I, T, let me tell you something. When I was in LA, homie, and my homies, they fuck with T. Rogers, hard body. You know what I'm saying? Got VIP, you know what I'm saying, to the homie. He like, yo, that, that coming over here and shit. Like, yeah, we, we finna come over there. We went to the jungles and all that, you know what I'm saying? But we never got up with them and shit. But remember I told you, I said, nigga, I said, damn, this store look familiar. That was the same store that they shot the motherfucking uh, baby boy. The nigga Jody jumped up. Nigga, we doing this? Woo. I said, you, and you were telling me. Look at Chris on jumping. Stalker. Fact, I was there, nigga. I, I bought my liquor there. I bought my liquor there, and I smashed through the jungles. You know what I'm saying? I went to the swap meet, hood day, get our shirts done. My homie's like, nah, bro, you, you can't wear that. Nigga, we got we, we gotta go to the swap meet and get your get your shirt hit up. So I'm right. like, all right, take me over. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We, 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 and it, we it was, was deep. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but, but it was all blood love though. You know what I'm saying? That love. Nobody, nobody said because you from New York, they didn't treat me no different than no. They said, nigga, long as you ain't on you, you, you with us, nigga. Long as you ain't over there, you with us, nigga. I'm right. not responsible for you. My He's told me, so you out here, nigga, I'm responsible for you. That's what the the first thing they told me, I'm responsible for you. So, nigga, you, you ain't doing all that other shit. The little homies is doing whoop de whoop. Nigga, you over here with the big homies. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't finna, you ain't going out there and do all that bullshit. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, nigga, I gotta come out, make a name for myself. They said, nigga, you already got a name. You already got a name, nigga. And I've been through situations out there in LA with the with the Florence and shit with the uh and 38th Street Hood niggas wrote, you know. I nigga, I never denied the fate. If a nigga want the fate, we would have got the fate. If we went to anything else, it would have been what it been. You know what I'm saying? It didn't really have to go too far, but I'm just saying, like the homies know I would stand up. You know what I'm saying? But I represented New York when I was there. I represented New York. Said nigga, you it's real niggas in New York, nigga. It's real niggas in New York. And we've been we we've been getting money and, and, and banging before we was down moves and rich a long time. We got a lot of OGs that put it down in New York. You know what I'm saying? We, we put it down like New York is a get money state. It's a lot of hustlers from New York, a lot of old school hustlers. You know what I'm saying? A lot of old school hustlers come out of New York, man, and motherfuckers put it down. They they laid the foundation for us. You know what I'm saying they laid the, they laid the, they laid the foundation for us. Even on the Damu tip, they laid the foundation down. You know what I'm saying in the penitentiary, Rikers Island. It was rough, man. The homies had it rough, man. The blacks had a rough, real bro. The blacks had it real rough back then, bro. You know what I'm saying? On some racial shit. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like out there with the Serenos and all that, but it, it, it was kind of similar. You know what I'm saying? It, 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 it didn't hit the streets. It was in the penitentiary. You know what I'm saying? So the homies had to band together. They had to stand for something. They, they would have fought for anything. They had to stand for something. You know what I'm saying? And the Damu culture and the Damu card, that, that's what it was. You know what I'm saying? That's what it was, man. You know? Nigga, blood run through our veins, man. And that shit run through the world, man. You know what I'm saying? Blood run through our veins and, and run through the world, man. Everybody got to bleed, homie. That's a, that, that's a fact. But it, even over here, though, like way back in the day, it always wasn't so good with the bloods in prison. That's why we got what we call Bloody July. When homies come together in, in the penitentiary and they celebrate. Because at one point, you know, in L.A., the Crips got us outnumbered at one point. Uh, sometime in the early 70s, man, don't quote me on the right year, but it was one point where they was just sending bloods to certain prisons. And, you know, some year in July and sometime in the 70s, niggas went on one and opened up them gates for niggas like me and you. Now we can walk the main line. You know what I'm saying? So we, LA went through that struggle too. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't always sweet. You know what I mean? Niggas, it's a fact. The G homies definitely opened up the gate for niggas like me coming through the penitentiary. Now I can walk the main line. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, so, and, and then, and that's what, and that's, that's why I'm glad to have you here. So, again, I don't want to get motherfuckers to get this shit misconstrued like we bashing the East Coast set. That's not what we're doing. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm inbred to embrace my homies. And when I say homies, 
I'm talking about all bloods and parus, period. Not just a brim nigga. I'm talking about all bloods, all parus. When I say homies, that's what I'm talking about. You know what I mean? So yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm glad to have you. I'm glad to have a New York native that's banging Pueblos, that's banging a West Side blood that they came to LA and got that blood love. You know what I'm saying? Niggas need to experience that shit. Like I, I got a home, a lot of homies in, in Charlotte. They came over here. They got that same blood love treatment. And when they go back, they move totally different. In Jersey, same way. A lot of these came over here. They got that blood love and see how we moving and all right. You know what I mean? Because blood, we're not bred like that. We don't beef with blood. So we don't do that, man. You, you seen the shit. You know the shit. You seen it firsthand. And I'm glad you seen it because you from New York, born and raised. So now when a nigga tell you that, you're like, blood, you can't tell me nothing. Nigga, I was over there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm saying like when I when I when I went to the West Coast and I came back, bro, like oh and, and you know you know what's the funny thing? I seen a nigga from my hood. He he don't bang or nothing like that. But he fuck with the 60s and shit. Like it's people who's he fuck with the 60s. And I'm like, yo, I'm out there and shit. He like, where you at? He like, yo, I'm over here in Western and shit. Yo, this nigga said, meet me at La Siena at the barbershop. So nigga, I'm pulling up. The nigga seen me, I was banged out. He like, nigga, you crazy. I said, nigga, this is what it is. It was just me and my girl. It was me, and a thousand homies. It was me and, and, and the chick I fuck with in LA. And she an older lady and shit. And her kids, they from they from Black Peace Stones and they from Pueblos. You know what I'm saying? So when he see me and shit, he didn't see us. She was in the car. He like, you, damn, nigga, like. flamed up? Of course. Of course. <laughs> yeah, he probably like, this nigga tripping. Because, you know, LA different, right? Shit. But, you know, LA, it ain't like different states and different cities where we got a whole city, nigga. You, you cross one street, you might be in enemy territory. You got on that red on it, it might be an issue. That's why that's why he probably looking at you like nigga, you tripping. <laughs> when I when I when I cross, when I cross, when I cross, I'm on Compton Avenue, right? I'm on 52nd Street in Compton, Diamonds Market, Pueblos, the projects. When I cross motherfucking uh Slauson, I'm in Firestone District, I'm in F13 hood. They see me banged out. Now you got the East Coasters up there. They, they got their own war going on. So the, them niggas on some racial shit. They're like, nigga, you, you, you from East Coast? I said, nah, I'm from New York, but I, I'm in the Pueblos, though. They're like, all right, homie, this this Florencia. I said, I know where I'm at. I see that big-ass arrow going to the floor that said F-13. I said, I know where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? And I, my first day in L.A., bro, and my homies told me. So no, when you say with the arrow on the wall, so tell them what you really mean by that. They hit their hood up and they put the arrow down. Let the arrow like this our hood. In the neighborhood, in the neighborhood. Every hood I went to, that's what it was. When I was on the west side, when I was smashing through eight trade hood, it was the same thing. You know what I'm saying? Sixties, nigga, enter at your own risk. A lot of shit say enter at your own risk. You know what I'm saying? If I'm lying, I'm flying. She say enter at your own risk. I'm like, damn, like it's yeah. active out here. When I was on the hood, spray paint they hood and they put the arrow going down, letting you know. Right here, this is us. <laughs> that was that arrow mean going down. When they put their hood and they put the arrow, they let you know that's them right there. Right. That was that, arrow, was a that arrow going down to that ground. That was that mean. That means that's their territory. That, that's their turf. When I was on one three five hood, Pi Rules and Comp, it was the same thing. Root Town probably was the same thing. Orchard Street, Chuck Plum, all that shit. Harbor City, Harbor City Crips. I'm, I'm smashing on through that shit. My homie's like, yeah, we going over here. I'm like, all right. Nigga, my first time, my second day in L.A., I went through uh, Avalon Gardens, the projects. I don't know if it's 70-something street or 80-something street. The projects. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, they off, they off, the gardens, they off 88. 88th Street, Avalon's. I go through there, you know what I'm saying? My homies was locked up with them niggas from Avalon. So they're like, yo, we, we going to meet my homies and shit I was in the pen with. I'm like, cool. So I'm on L.A. time. so. Just say we go out there about nine o'clock in LA time. It's about nine, about 12 o'clock in New York. So it's early and shit. My second day in LA, nigga. I go through that shit, all I hear is screaming. Girls fighting, ah! Nigga, they got blue hair, blue fingernails, blue low riders. Niggas is banged out, 9.30 in the morning. I went in there, my homie's like, yo, man. Yo, we, we going to these niggas' projects. You gotta take the hat off, man. I had a red P hat on. My P ass at LA to NY on it. They said, yo, bro, it ain't like no we ain't no suckers or no no we a, a, LA they say weenies. We ain't no weenies, nigga. We ain't no weenies, but you know, we in these niggas' neighborhood, man. You, you gotta you gotta you gotta show respect. Yeah, you, know, you gotta you gotta take the hat off. You 
Yeah, take the hat off, bro. Like, ain't no problems. It ain't nothing. But, you know, I said, all right, bro. Nigga, as soon as I get out of the car, where you from, cuz? I said, I'm from New York, but I'm, on the, I'm in the bottoms, though, in the Pueblo. What's up? These niggas got tattoos. They got the, the, the fingers and shit, like, the shit, like, fingers tattoos on their body. And print and all that shit, Avalon, all over their body and shit. You know what I'm saying? Shirts off. Niggas is banged out. They're like, we, I said, New York. Niggas show me love, bro. They show me love. Open arms like this. Shaking my hand, bro. Like, yo, what's so love out here, man? We like how y'all New York niggas get down, man. We respect that. We, we, they talking about, yeah, niggas got hoods over here. We got hoods over there. Like, it was all love. You know what I'm saying? It was all love. Like, not even on, on some a blood of shit, on some black love shit. Like, they show love. You know what I'm saying? Same thing with the Great Street. You know what I'm saying? G.I. Peter, uh, my nigga Mafia Ray, Peter Roe Mafia. You know what I'm saying? That was the first crypt that I met when I was in L.A. Niggas showed straight love, bro. Straight love, you know what I'm saying? It was all love. Like, nobody didn't say, oh, nigga, you, you, you're a dime move from New York. Nigga, what you doing out here? It wasn't none of that. It was all love, bro. Like, even the women, bro, let me tell you something. The women out there, they, they nigga, they, they were jacking me, bro. They were jacking the New York shit. <laughs> from New York? I'm going to go to New York. I want to go to Times Square. I said, yeah. shit, I'll take you to Times Square. <laughs> And that's a fact. You gotta look at it. They tired of us, LA niggas. They be seeing us all their life. You got a nigga from NY coming. You know, keep talking different. He ain't nobody, baby daddy. He ain't nobody, husband. Man, you free game. So I know they, the women probably eat you up. You know what I'm saying? That's a fact. Let me tell you something. <laughs> the, the, the girl I was fucking with, I was like 20 something at the time, right? And she probably like in her 40s, right? But. Mm -hmm. My homeboy, that's his mom. He from the set. You know what I'm saying? Her daughter from the set. Her son, uh, B.I.P. from P. Stones. Her other daughter from P. Stones and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, they was all showing love, bro. And she took me to the funeral. I I, I guess that's in Crenshaw or something like that. The forum, the forum was not too far. It was like the... the uh, um, I use the Inglewood man. Cemetery. Inglewood Cemetery. So he was in a wall and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, they had a, his plot was in the wall. Yeah, like, she sure. like look to your left. She like she like look to your left. I looked to my left. It's a whole gang funeral right up there. They was yeah. rips and shit. They had yeah. all black with the blue ties on. She like look over there. It's like rips, diamonds. It, it was it was crazy. You know what I'm saying? I'm like damn, like you yeah. know what I'm saying. Yeah. Everybody was showing up. Nobody yeah. was tripping. You know but what I'm saying? You, even with a cemetery is big as fuck. So you know. Niggas die every day, nigga, in every city. It's it, it been plenty of times like that. When we got a funeral, like you said, nigga, look over there. The Crips, they burying somebody. You look over there, the Hoovers might be burying somebody. But we all at Eaglewood Cemetery, and it's big as a motherfucker. And like you said, right. how y'all hit the swap meet. And uh, that was Fa Day, right? That's a fact. That was and y'all going to swap Tuesday. meet, y'all yeah. shit airbrushed and all that. Y'all like, we ran into such and such different hoods. So now you got to think in L.A., Fadu's day is a lot of games. You got Fadu's Peblos. Yeah, you got Fadu's Broadway. Fadu's Broadway. Everybody getting their first leg. Everybody getting their everybody getting they, they chucks, they rags. Everybody outside turned up. <laughs> right. That's a so fact. You got to experience I, that shit firsthand, man. man. Them niggas, them niggas, we driving in traffic. You know what I'm saying? It's my first time seeing this shit. Niggas hanging out the window, banging in traffic, passing blunts, car to car. Driving, driving down, I'm like, driving down slow. I'm like, damn, this is my first time seeing this shit. You know what I'm saying? You got niggas from other sets. They right next to the other cars. You got, you got uh, niggas from Hoovers. They got the H with the five on their shit. They mm -hmm. drive down and, you know, niggas ain't disrespecting their hood, but niggas just banged out. You know what I'm saying? Niggas just banged out, man. I go inside that swap meet. I tell you, I seen this sheriff. That nigga had all green on with a big ass shotgun over his shoulder. Like, nigga, you niggas start gang banging their head. We gonna start banging too. <laughs> yeah. That's a classic, you know man. Legendary Slawson swap meet, nigga. Yeah, man. That's a fact. And I keep, I tell the homies, I said, nigga, Pelos, we got our, nigga, we got Damu's Market. And nigga, I ain't been nowhere on this planet and you see a sword that's named Damu's Market. That shit is in big embroidery letters. <laughs> Damu's Market. On <laughs> I'm lying, I'm swamping. Uh. Damu's Market. Not damn use or let's just say Damu's market, man. Fact, right across the street from the project. Banged right. out. Right. Well, that's a fact, man. I was gonna say rest in peace to the big homie Big Capone. You know what I'm saying? Rest in peace to my nigga uh 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 dog. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh Bolo, 
my nigga P. Steve, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 Baby Ben in the, in, the, in the penitentiary. Shout out to Big J Killer, you know what I'm saying? Big Dulo, you know what I'm saying? All my niggas, man, you know. Them niggas, them niggas just called me the other day, man. Hit me up on the Facebook. Yo, Block, what's up? I said, I'll be out there in a minute. I just got off parole, so I couldn't go to L.A., you know what I'm saying? I just got off parole, so I, could, I, I missed a few hood days, you know what I'm saying? But the homies checking with me all the time. I check in with them. You know what I'm saying? The homies from Connecticut, they go out there and they chop it up all the time. So, you know, we united, man. And, and I, I tell niggas, so listen, there's a difference between a gang banger and a gang member. Everybody in the gang bang. Facts. Everybody not promoting the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Facts. There's levels to the shit. Facts. There's levels to it. You know what I'm saying? The, my big homies told me, you know what they told me? Nigga, you ain't banging out here. Nigga, don't worry about that. Nigga, we, this is already set in stone. You ain't got to do nothing. Niggas want to be with you just because, just because, nigga. That's you ain't fact. from you ain't you ain't from, like, you from New York, nigga. We trying to do whoop de woo. We trying to put some uh pieces to the puzzle together, nigga. Let's make this a worldwide thing happen. That's Let's do this music thing. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying my nigga, my nigga Paul A. Star from the bottles from Pella. That nigga come to New York. Yo, Trey, I'm I'm in New York right now. Where you at, blood? I'm in the studio by Madison Square Garden. I go over there. I'm in the fucking million dollar studio with this nigga. This nigga from the pedals on the bottoms, recording tracks. Got my homies from Brooklyn. It was all love, you know what I'm saying? It was all love, bro. It was all love, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't like, oh, nigga, you from New York, so the politics. It wasn't about no politics. It was about Damu love. You know what I'm saying? When you come out here, bro. Guess what? You know why, though, Trey? Because at that point, we can care less you being from New York. You were blood at that point. That's why I tell you. I could be at a function. I could be at the swap meet. I could be in jail. I don't give a fuck if you from Alaska or China. If you a blood, you my homie now. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, that's a fact. That's a fact. That a that fact, blood man. shit override anything, nigga. You a blood, nigga. You know what I mean? A, we ain't gonna treat you like yeah. And it ain't no East Coast, West Coast beat. Ain't no none of that. No, this nigga a blood. We gonna treat him like like one of our. Try, nigga, what's up? Drink you smoking? What you need? You a blood. That's that real blood love. You know what I mean? I'm glad that you got to experience it. So when niggas say that blood love ain't real, you know, like, nigga, stop lying, nigga. I've seen it with my own two eyes. You know what I mean? It's real, bro. It's real. It's real. I wish I had one of my homies right now to call up in this motherfucking shit. But it's real, though. It's real, though, man. Like, to the bottoms right now, bro, I say, yo, you know some nigga named Trey from New York? Oh, Yo, yeah, that's my nigga. That's my nigga. I want blood. Hey, the niggas gonna boss me. I don't know every nigga from the Pueblos. I'm saying, like, I was telling you about uh, 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 the homie that just came home and shit. When, when I was out there, blood was locked up. You know I'm saying? Blood was locked up. Now he home and shit. But the, hom- the homie just did a video. I forgot what video it was. He's like, oh, he's like, Pueblo. He's like, nigga, we got Pueblos in Brooklyn, Connecticut. Nigga, we all always said this is the foundational, but nigga, those are the homies. You know what I'm saying? Those are the homies and shit. You know what I'm saying? Low Bo, you know what I'm saying? Bo, Bo was like, nigga, we got homies all over. Shout out and that's to a South, fact. South Project Bo. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? Like, I talked to my homies, man, Tiny Bank upon them niggas in Mississippi, them niggas in Stone Mountain, Atlanta, Georgia. Like, them niggas calling me, you know, we talk. Oh, I'm in the pen right now, blood. Like, what's happening? You good? Yeah, man. My, my, my girl on Long Island and shit. Whoa. I don't, don't worry about it. We, you know, we gonna connect the dots, you know what I'm saying? When you come home, nigga, yeah, nigga, I'm coming to New York, though. When you paroling to, yeah, my, you know. So I'm like, nigga, you, you got a place out here, bro. Like, ain't, 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 ain't no, like, no no love loss or nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? Like, out here, bro, the homies is deep, you know what I'm saying? But it's just, like, a lot of misguided niggas, man. Niggas is misguided, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? It ain't all about banging, bro. And I be trying to tell my... my the little homies, the young homies, like, whatever sets you from, like, yo, bro, like, it ain't got to be like that, my nigga. It's up 